the next question is in transformers topic this is a previous gate question again a single phase 50 kva 250 by 500 volt two winding transformer has an efficiency of 95 percent at full load unity power factor if it is reconfigured as 500 by 750 volt auto transformer its percent efficiency at its new rated load at unity power factor will be given clearly two winding transformer is reconfigured as 500 by 750 volt auto transformer they have already guided you in which way you have to reconnect the two winding transformer as an auto transformer clearly they mentioned 500 by 750 first you know two winding transformer Two fifty by five hundred. It's fifty kV. So I L V means L V side. What is the current rating? Fifty kV by two fifty. I H V side. 50 kVA by 500. Remember one thing when you are solving auto transformer questions particularly a two winding transformer reconnected as an auto transformer you should remember this particular point like you should not violate the current ratings of the windings as well as voltage ratings of the windings you have to maintain them as they are that's compulsory condition so first this is the current rating of lv winding this is the current rating of h winding fine now as per the given guideline you have to reconnect a two winding transformer two winding transformer is becoming one winding transformer so two windings must be connected as one winding means both the windings must be connected in series in such case you can connect them in additive polarity mode you can connect them in subtractive polarity mode here additive means 250 plus 500 subtractive means difference of 250 and 500 it's very clear it is additive polarity mode only because 750 you are seeing so that side output side 750 input side 500 so common winding is 500 winding the common winding is 500 volt winding because input side 500 output side 750 so common part should be 500 non-common winding will be 250 with additive polarity i will draw you will understand easily indicates additive polarity i will take this 500 volt winding this is 500 volt winding this is 250 volt winding both additive polarity mode so here the output voltage is 750 here 500 volt common winding is 500 500 250 additive polarity 750 so this is 500 volt by 750 volt auto transformer first what is the current rating of 250 volt winding fix it first you must fix it first start with that point current rating of this winding is 200 
so obviously i2 is 200 that's it the current should flow in this winding must be 200 only because the rating of that particular winding is 200 ampere that's it so if you connect a load that load must carry 200 only that's the meaning so across the load this voltage is called as v2 the current flowing in the load is called as i2 so what is the output of auto transformer in other words what is capacity what is rating of auto transformer all communicate the same meaning generally we call it as rating of auto transformer simple is V2 I2 that is 750 into 150 kVA remember you should not violate the current ratings Without violating the current rating and voltage rating, the power transfer capability of an auto transformer will be enhanced like anything. See, 50 kVA became 150 kVA without overloading anything. Observe that. In a transformer generally, V1I1 is equal to V2I2. So, I1 value is V2I2 by V1 that is 150 kVA by v1 what is v1 500 300 ampere now i1 is 300 ampere at this particular node we have to apply kcl compulsory it must be satisfied 300 ampere is entering 200 is leaving that way so obviously in this side in this particular winding what is the current means 100 ampere 300 entering 200 100 total 300 now check once this winding current rating is 100 satisfied this winding current rating is 200 satisfied now you are right absolutely right this check you have to maintain next what you are asked is if it is reconfigured as an auto transformer its efficiency you are asked right to find efficiency two things are required one is output rating other one is losses remember in such kind of questions which are common in such kind of questions you can directly take losses of a two winding transformer as equal to losses of auto transformer you will definitely think why on which basis generally what we read auto transformer losses are lesser lesser when you compare equal ratings in the sense if you compare a 50 kVA two winding transformer with 50 kVA auto transformer, in such case, in auto transformer losses are lesser. But now don't say losses why it is equal, it is lesser because that case is not there. Here it is 150 kVA auto transformer, it became same two winding transformer, just reconnected, same device became auto transformer with 150 kVA without changing voltage rating and current rating. Mind this word, voltage rating, current rating remains the same and you all know that iron losses depends on voltage rating, copper losses depends on current rating or current flowing in the windings. So, in this winding 250, 
current is 200 ampere in this winding 500 volt current is 100 ampere you are doing the same thing even the two winding transformer is used as auto transformer in this mode also same voltage you are up you are maintaining across the windings as well as same current is flowing in the windings why the losses will differ hope you understood losses two losses in transformers one is iron loss depends on voltage across the windings done voltage across the windings is absolute, absolutely same 250 500 done same 250 500 you are not changing anything similarly current in the winding in this winding current is 200 same in this winding current is 100 same so what is the loss when it was a two winding transformer what is the loss when it is auto transformer will be absolutely same now we'll continue What I told you, I wrote here. I'll continue. Efficiency of two winding transformer is given as ninety five percent at full load, unity power factor. full load unity power factor at full load unity power factor what is output of the two winding transformer at full load unity power factor what is output of two winding transformer that is the target output is 50 kva into unity power factor 1 50 kva is output actually in kva unity power factor 1 so you know cos phi is kilowatt by kva 1 so kilowatt is equal to kva 50 kilowatt then input of two winding transformer output by efficiency you know output you know input difference of these two is absolutely losses now you can take the same loss for auto transformer because of the reasons I explained already. So, efficiency of auto transformer for same loading will be 150 kVA is the rating of auto transformer for full load 150 kVA unity power factor obviously into 1 efficiency will be.
वन फिफ्टी के वी ए फुल लोड एन इंटू के वी ए इंटू वन कैंड ऑफ बै वन फुल लोड वन वन फिफ्टी यूनिटी पॉ फैक्टर प्लस लॉसस् टू पॉइंट सिक्स थ्री C is the answer.